Well, I'm not sure whether this is going to fit the 16 inch covert model or the, the bigger version, the 26 inch SRS. I'm not sure whether it can be adjusted. I have no idea. So let's get my SRS out and we'll put it on. There we go. This is the amber kit for the SRS. It doesn't come with a scope cover, so you're going to have to do something about that yourself. Getting it on took me maybe five or ten minutes. It's pretty straightforward. Um, this is a small suppressor I've got on here, the one I don't usually use. But there is plenty of stretch there to cover a larger suppressor. Uh, the cutouts there for the rails. There's no cutouts for the side rails or further forward on the rails. The rails do come up to here on this SRS. Um, you can probably use the use the rail underneath by moving these elastic cords, but if you're gonna to wanna to use the side rails, you're gonna to have to probably make some decisions. Um, but it's, it's ripe for crafting. A few leaves on there, a few artificial leaves, a bit of spray paint to dull down the colors, get it a bit muddy, and uh, you, you're good to go with this. It's for, for those guys like myself, I never could bring myself to paint my SRS. I'm, I'm like it with most of my airsoft rifles. I hate painting the airsoft rifles. So anything like this, a cover that I can craft is very welcomed. On the other side there, you've got the opening for, I've got no spring in there at the moment. That's why it's uh, flopping about like that. Unfortunately for you left-handed people, there is no version for you. Whether Norbridge will come out with a left-handed version of this uh, cover in the future, I don't know. But at the moment, I'm afraid to say right-handed only. There is a hole there for the mag release. This um, back piece is elasticated with Velcro. And you also have another bit of Velcro holding the bottom on. This piece here is Velcroed on as well. Plenty of space to get your mag in there. Let's have a look at the material that it's made from. Well, the material this these ghillie covers are made from is a very, um, very strong mesh. You can see it's a really, really strong base. And then the, the leafy bits actually remind me of the like the Chinese type of um, ghillie suits that you can get off Amazon and eBay, um, but definitely not the mesh. The mesh is very, the base mesh is very, very strong, and it has these fine holes in here. So if you like to craft your rifles, and uh, attach fake vegetation. Very easy to attach these little zip ties to, to add fake veg and fake leaves and uh, raffia and such like. And um, yeah, so it's extremely strong and I'm now gonna show you exactly how strong it is. It can take my, my heavy weight, so just watch this. Thanks for watching guys. If you do fancy getting yourself one of these, uh, check out the link in the description below and uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.